This is Twit. Paul, you've been playing with the Outlook, the One Outlook client, I hear. Little bird Woo-hoo. tells me. Yeah. I got it. Yeah. I got it too. Both of you. Oh, did you yeah. try it? Oh, interesting. Yeah. So it only and then it only works for commercial <laughs> accounts, uh, which is it does. Yep. And education. And by I the way, too, right? I, if, you, if you follow the stink show that's occurred uh, because this leak, like Microsoft's really upset yeah. about this, and like they a lot of the MVP it. types. That, <laughs> well, I know, but a lot of people that are under NDA have been really upset, and like you know, yeah. so they've. Yeah. Some of them have kind of come out and started writing about it. And then other MVPs are like, what are you doing? You're violating your NDA. And it's like, yeah. it's not public. It's like, you still yeah. can't talk about that. And like, there's yeah. been a whole, like, just like, this is caused, this is like going back to the 90s. Do you, when people do you think they like, really, that it really was Microsoft that leaked it? I think they accidentally uh, leaked oh, it. Oh, it wasn't on purpose. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Here's the thing. Yeah, but- I, we can talk about what it, what this is specifically. But I, yeah. I the, my takeaway right off the top was, We've been waiting for this thing for a long time, right? Yeah. This has been discussed or rumored for uh, not years, but a year couple or more, years. a year and a half, yep. a couple of years. Mm-hmm. Okay, um, it was supposed to uh, ship late last year, and it was delayed. Yep. They probably would have timed it to ignite, I would imagine. Um, mm-hmm. So we've been waiting, we've been waiting, we've been waiting. We've been hearing April, May. May is when build is. So like maybe they're going to time it to build for some reason, mm-hmm. whatever. You could sort of, if you would ask me a month or two ago, what do you think this thing is? I might have given you a certain answer around. A modified version of the web apps that we have, like Outlook mm-hmm. on the web or Outlook.com, whatever, and uh, and then it leaked, and it's Outlook on the web in a app yep. window, <laughs> <laughs> and I, I don't know if it works offline or not. I actually never tested that. Um, I assume it does, um, I, or will I don't, at least. Uh, yeah, I, I don't understand yeah. what we've been waiting for here. Like this is, yeah. <laughs> it's fine. It's absolutely yeah. better than those mail and calendar apps in Windows 10 and 11. No doubt about that, but. Why have we waited for this? <laughs> like, what is yeah. this thing? Like, it's okay. just the web app. Yeah. So right? this is what we're talking about is Project Monarch, which we've talked about on the show a lot, mm-hmm. also called One Outlook. So the idea, the reason Microsoft's building this is for them, right? They want to have one code base that works on Windows, mm-hmm. on the web, and on the Mac, right? Right now, all these different things are different code bases. So when they update features, it comes to one platform, then another, and they have to try to keep them in yeah. sync and add features over here and there. So when they have this code base done, and it is actually the same product that works on all these platforms, it's going to be much easier for them to roll out features quickly and for users you'll get features faster okay um yeah it looks exactly like outlook for the web the one thing i notice you can't do is add a, multiple accounts which i also would right. assume are co- is coming um you know add so Gmail, let me ask you about that real quick other, if you don't mind um yeah. Also, last week, well, you were out gallivanting around. I don't know what you were doing. Um, <laughs> Eating dumplings in Chinatown. <laughs> <Yep. laughs> there was a story about uh, Microsoft has brought back uh, multi-account support to Office.com, which is very mm-hmm. interesting. This is something yep. you used to be able to do way back in the day. And there was some some technical complexity that caused them to kill this feature. But the idea is you have, you know, maybe you sign into Outlook. Well, actually, that made this not a great example. You sign into Office.com. And you have a, yep. a personal Microsoft account like I do. And you have a commercial Microsoft account, like I also do. Yeah. And you want to just switch between those things. You don't want to have to go through the whole sign out, laboriously mm-hmm. sign in, 2FA, blah, 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 whatever. Yeah. So they've added that capability. Well, I mean, Outlook.com and Outlook on the web are in this ballpark, right? Um, yeah. It seems like that capability could be coming and that mm-hmm. maybe that's the way they'll do it, the way we see it on Office.com. Mm-hmm. You know, It's just mm-hmm. not in that app mm-hmm. yet. Maybe. Right. That was Although... My- I, I have people who got the leaked build who say they have mm-hmm. the capability in their app. So they may be oh. rolling it out in a way that some people are getting the right. features earlier than others and some aren't. Um, Do you know how it works? Is it actually a feature, you know, you go to settings, add account, or is it like I a, don't know. you know, okay. Yeah, I, I don't know. Um, yeah, it was funny. I, I almost never download leaked stuff because I'm afraid <laughs> to do it. And I'm also like, what am I going to do with it? But this one, because sure. I've covered it for so long, as soon as I saw the leak on Windows Central, I'm like, I'm just going to download it. And I clicked the link and it downloaded. And right after it downloaded, I get a message saying, you do not have access to this. But I'm like, no, I got it right before they tried to shut me out, right? And um, What? Then, they actually yeah, tried to shut I got out. I got a message oh, in my in my browser saying you do not have access, you cannot get this app. And then I'm like, I got it though. There it is. It's it's here. I've got it. And then I'm like, eh, there's, there's nothing to see really. Okay. And that and then a guy from Microsoft, no, a guy from Microsoft goes on Twitter and he says, um, 
Mary Jo, did you think this just might be a honeypot for us to collect all your email information? Like you, you got to build. By the way, a, I'm like, that's what? A, that's funny. <laughs> that's funny and illegal and, and nice no, of you to say was, that out loud. It was definitely a joke. It was definitely. Jeez. A joke. But <laughs> but he's like, oh, and I said, I'm t- I took one for the team. <laughs> You know, but yeah, so far, uh, I, mean, actually, so far I, just, I agree with you. There's nothing there to see. Like, it's not that interesting, right? It's the concept it, is good. <laughs> oh, no, I, I don't I, I, I don't dislike it. I, I think no. the issue is just yeah. the anticipation was so great. Right. Uh, and then it's like, oh, it's just the it's a web. It does Although, open sub windows, which I like. It, yeah, Some it of does. the links open in a yeah. browser tab, which is weird, which also yeah. speaks to it being a web app, right? It's also a preview. It's early, right? Yeah, this yeah. Is not no, it's the it, final I, version, right? I just, I'm just surprised it wasn't more different. I, you, after all yeah. the delays, I sort of assumed yeah. they must be working on something spectacular here. Yeah. And it's like, oh, it's the web app, you know, which is fine. No, which I didn't is not th- bad. I don't mean it. No, all the leaks were like, it's going to look just like Outlook.com, and I'm like, it probably will because that's kind of they think that's a good design, and that's where they're going with this, right? Yeah, the tool, it supports the same, the same kind of, kind of like the, you know, you can do themes on yeah. these apps. Yeah. It does yep. the same thing. The header changes, whatever. It's fine. You know, it's yeah, fine. Yeah. It is. Um, it's fine. Yeah. Of course, people who like the Outlook, native Outlook client and windows are freaking out about this because they're looking at this and going, yep. okay, you can't do this. You can't do this. I don't like it. Well, listen, I, no, dinosaurs, I, I there's that. an asteroid heading for the <laughs> earth and it's got your name on it. <laughs> so do you think, do you think they'll actually replace it or just put it in with it? Um, so the rumor I heard, the last rumor was, um, Microsoft plans to try to do this gradually, right? So at maybe yeah. before the end of the year, it'll be in Windows 11 alongside the mail and calendar app. And then at some point they'll be like, okay guys, we're trying to wean you off the mail and calendar app, blah, blah, blah. And they're not just one day going to take the mail and calendar app out suddenly and like, boom, here's so, your new thing. They're not going to do that. But what if you're not using this, uh, Outlook Mail or Outlook.com Mail? Will it still... Is it is it a full mail client? Yes. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, it works and with calendar. your well. Mail calendar. Yeah. 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 So and, and contact. So you could replace yeah. mail yeah. with it then. Okay. You could. Oh yeah. Just the yeah, name yeah. makes me think it's like well, it's Outlook.com for the desktop kind of. But it's also it's also not like well, what about Office, right? So if you have a Microsoft 365 yeah. account, you go to Office.com and you download Office. Right yeah. now, you get the desktop version and of you got Outlook. Outlook. Yeah. At some point, yeah. is this going to be? replace you know, that i, I don't would know. guess so, yes lauren, lauren sent me a uh, a message that was i think in the um i don't know if it was in microsoft 365 or office to come somewhere you know that talked yeah. about how this was an unsupported you know early test version etc yeah. it said this version is missing some of the key features and enhancements that will be available later for our mm-hmm. customers in the beta channel beta right. channel of office <laughs> like, or or, Wind- my guess is windows yeah okay i was curious what that meant yeah. We yeah. encourage customers to wait for the beta version to be released. Yeah. yeah. Hmm. Okay. Yeah. So I my my message to people is it's out in a leaked form. You can download it or not download it. I don't think they've removed the link to download it. Um, they're cautioning people. Uh, not all the features are there. They said it's going to be yeah. in the beta channel within a couple weeks or in the coming weeks, right? So that can mean anything. It can mean months from now. It could be. Right. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, but, yeah, but the important thing works. to know is you can't you can't just use it if you have a Microsoft account. You you have to have a commercial. Right. You have to have which either is a work business or yep. education or yeah. education. Right. If you yeah, just if you have, have that, Microsoft just, personal or home, you can't use it. It's not yep. not going to work. No. Yeah. Now I assume so eventually far. it will work. Right. And I assume eventually right. they'll have some form of multi account. So we'll see. Yep. Mm-hmm. I think it looks fine. I just again I it, <laughs> I don't understand why this is taking so long. And yeah. I think because it has taken so long, I thought, man, they must, they must have something special planned here. And yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah. it's fine. It's fine. Yeah, it's fine. It's, like I said, but it is absolutely better than the stuff built into Windows today. It is. It is. It's nice. But if you had Office, wouldn't you just use Outlook? I don't By the way, they've yeah. got well, to solve this naming. Um, they've got to solve this naming. <laughs> no, everything's it's it's going to just be called Outlook again. It's, they're it's just so going to call it Outlook. <laughs> Yeah. So confusing. Yeah, I know. I know. What, and one Outlook is a perfect name for something that has 17 versions. Yes, you know? right. There is no one. Outlook, no, there is Outlook no Legion, one. you know. Yeah. I don't know. No and they don't want to call it Outlook Express for obvious reasons. So, 
Right. But now, and is. then the outlook that's on your phone, that's not going to change. Yeah. That's still a comply under the covers, right? Like that's not mm -hmm. going to become the one outlook oh thing. Oh, my God. Gonna, uh, maybe, yeah. that, maybe that's the next step, though. Once you've got the base, the code base moved over to <laughs> this, you could do a new mobile client. Maybe. Are there so yeah. few names left? No, you know, Microsoft wants to pretend <laughs> things are unified that aren't unified. So right. that's why they do right. things like that with the name. It's mail. All mail's Outlook, right? All mail is Outlook, guys. That's it. Mm-hmm.